How's it going everyone? This is Abe's Car Collection back with another mail day video. Happy Friday. Let's take a look at the purchases over the last week. I'm going to start a little weird. I did go to a thrift store, which is a little out of my realm, but thought it'd be fun to go to. Ended up picking up this. Oh, can't even see it. Hey, it's Jose Guillen from I think 2006. It was a giveaway at Nats Park. Picked that up for $6. There is no box, but that is okay. Also picked up some TTM fuel. $1 for this 81 Donruss Andre Dawson card. And then, I don't know how well this is going to show, but for $6.50, this is a program. Capital, All Capital Classic All-Star Game. That's Mike Baby on the front. Been a pretty good TTMer. Got him once before. Might send this off to him. It was only $6.50. So, that was the haul from the flea market. But let's get to the traditional mail. Some cool, uh, cool stuff. Nothing like crazy high dollar. But just some good ads for the collection this week. We're going to start with just that. Love Brooks Robinson. This is a 2021... Tops Chrome Platinum Anniversary uh, Refractor. It was only a dollar or two. Maybe, I think it was a dollar and a dollar shipping. So, again, just some cool stuff for the collection this week. Next, we have another eBay envelope. Let's pull this off to the side just for a second. Oh boy, what is all that? Got some checklists in here. Just kidding. Oh, this is TTM Fuel. This is Patrick Kearney, 2008 or 7, 2008 I think. Topps Chrome, bronze refractor, should be numbered somewhere. There it is, 425. He signs TTM. I believe he was Defensive Player of the Year with the Seahawks. So, yeah, I'm going to send that one out. I think I have another card to pair with it. So, pretty nice Patrick Kearney, bronze refractor. Of course, want to get the refractor signed. Next, we have another PWE. What is going on here? Where's the card? The price. Oh, this actually took a while to get to me. Give me a second. Bear with me. It's two dollars and seventy some cents. Heinz Ward. We actually got the blue version of this. The blue refractor signed by Heinz a couple months ago at a card show. This is the red version. So, plenty of room right here for an autograph. The blue one turned out so well, I thought I'd add the red. Not numbered, of course, but had a 2005 Bowman Chrome. Really like Heinz Ward. Been picking up a lot of his refractors lately. Got another envelope here. I don't even think we have a bubble mailer. Let's see. Get the paper out of the way. <laughs> I bought this. I was at a Washington Nationals game and in between innings, back-to-back -back green tape, I bought this Prism Refractor Rookie of Joey Manessas for like $1.20. So I think I'm going to send this out TTM at some point. Probably going to have to wait for spring training next year. But again, just another cool collection ad, maybe TTM ad. We'll see. The next one is an envelope. And it is TTM Fuel. Got Lenny Wilkins on the back there. I believe this is like a buy five, get free shipping or buy, I don't know. I think buy five. It was buy five, get one free. So, but Mark Chimera, Refractor from 1998 Topps Chrome. Never sent to him before. This is why I did it though. A rookie card, I believe, or second year card of Hugh Douglas. Mostly known for his time with the Eagles, I think, but I, he may have been Rookie of the Year with the Jets. But that is a Topps Finest Refractor. That is a cool card. Mike Cameron, uh, 2007, I think, Topps Chrome, White Refractor. A Robert Parrish, Topps Finest Refractor from like 1996 or 7. That is super cool. And then a Lenny Wilkins Refractor. Don't even know what this is. It's Topps All-Stars from 19-something or another. 1996. Jeez. 
That is an old school refractor, but he of course signs. Give him a, I think it's a $5 donation for his foundation. He'll even put Hall of Fame on there. So some pretty cool, good TTM fuel. We do have a bubble mailer. Who is it? Oh, I think I know who this is. No surprise. Cabert Ruiz. Blue refractor. We've got two blue refractors of his now. And he's been hidden lately. Game I, I mentioned, the Nats game I went to where I bought the Manessas card. He actually hit a walk-off homer against the A's. So, yeah, I think I, I bought this though before then. Pretty cool. I think I bought this like the day before or like a few hours before maybe the day of the game in that morning yeah Cabert Ruiz big fan of his he's starting to hit it's always been a really good defensive catcher and he's the national I picked this year to kind of collect it's either gonna be him or CJ Abrams and Abrams has been phenomenal but Cabert's come around how about a Dan Deardorff rookie card very nice Gonna put that one right there. Next we have another envelope. Of course, Dan Deodorf, I think, has been signing TTM. I haven't sent to him before though. How about this Rocky Blyer Tops Chrome card? Got another Rocky card to send. I'll probably, you know, hope he signs right there. That's a really nice card from 2006, I think, or 2008. Yeah, 2008. Really nice cards. What do we have next? Got an envelope I just ripped open to shreds. Some paper here. Come on. Oh, this guy, yeah. Another Dan Deodorf rookie. So I got two of them. It wasn't intentional per se. I think one was actually $10 and one was like $3. So I put a bid on one. And then I uh, put up another bid on another one, both of them. Looks like we got one or two bubble mailers left. We got two bubble mailers left for the week. Another Cabert Ruiz. <laughs> this of the Mojo variety, not a first Bowman Chrome, but it is from 2018. So, geez, I don't know how many Cabert autographs I've acquired over the last year and a half, but it's it's been a lot. They're cheap. It was like $5 on bid, $5 to ship. And then the last one is an odd looking bubble mailer. Oh, this is cool. I actually think this was a first time seller on eBay. Um, obviously I didn't open it yet, but he had zero feedback. And I think this went super cheap because of that. And he sent it like, super quick like he got here in like two days of winning the auction but a charles haley beckett certified pretty fresh looking slab even got it auto graded but that's his rookie card charles haley won five super bowls in his nfl career and he charges like 45 to 50 at a card show card will set you back a dollar or two maybe and then the beckett that's probably 10 to 25 dollars i don't know to get that any depending on if you're not during a special or something but i got this for under 20 dollars shipped i think it was 14 dollars on bid and five dollars shipped another dollar or so in tax i don't know but that's a pretty good deal and i think it's because he had zero feedback and i gotta give, leave him pretty good feedback because he got it here in like two days but charles haley Gotta love that. So we end off pretty with a pretty good bang there with a uh, Hall of Fame rookie card signed. But what do you think? TTM Fuel, nice Abe's uh, collection going on here with some Cabert Ruiz falling down and some Heinz Ward back there and some Brooks Robinsons. A little bit of TTM Fuel, not too, too much. But thanks for watching. Bye for now.